card for Wednesday, December the 4th. And I'm going to start today with a card from the Archangels, uh, the Guardian Angels deck. And I'm going to ask again, right, um, it's just kind of come to me because I'm looking at the heart shapes of these cards and I'm connecting and I'm saying, are we really asking about expansion again? And my guide just said to me, yes, expansion of the heart. <laughs> so I think that's perfect. So I'm going to ask, what do we need today to help us to expand our hearts? What do we need to help us to expand our capacity to love? How about that? Right, okay. So, and the card I've got is action. <gasps> Right, okay, so it says drop all fear and just do it. Drop all fear and just do it. So I'm gonna say first of all, drop all fear and just love someone today. So if there is anything that you're holding back on, if you're holding back on expressing your feelings towards someone, if you are holding back from being close to people um, in your uh, in immediate environment, or if you're just feeling that you want to step back and not be involved, or if there's anything at all that's stopping you from allowing yourself to be loving as an action. So in other words, we talk about love an awful lot. We think about love, we write about love, we think we know what it means. We think we know what we mean when we write about it. We think we know what we mean when we talk about it. But in a sense, it becomes meaningless when we talk about it, when we write about it, when we think about it, because it is an action. Loving is an action. To love is an action. So I think what that means is it's an important thing for us to remember today that love is a verb. To love is a verb. It's not a concept. I don't think it's really supposed to be a noun. I suppose I think it's supposed to be a word of action. So it's really a good day to do something loving. To do something that reminds us how loving we can do we can be and that reminds us to expand our hearts. And I'm kind of feeling it's coming up to Christmas now and I know that a lot of people will be wondering about what they're going to do for Christmas or what maybe what they can do for someone else. And I'm feeling this is the energy of today. It's about thinking ahead and expanding our hearts in the direction of how we can become more compassionate and then and also how we can open our hearts up to receiving more love and being more loving in the moment. So perform a loving action today and then if you like you can come back and tell me what you did. And I'm going to pick a card from the Secret Language of Colour deck just to go with that. And I'm asking what can we do? What do we need to know most now about how to expand our hearts and our collective consciousness of love on this planet, each one of us. And it says connect to spirit in nature. So I have to say that when we become isolated, when we start to think that we're alone or we think that we are living in a mechanised, work-drilled, um, insanely uh, picky and detailed in in this highly technological way kind of universe and therefore we can't connect anymore with each other we can't feel ourselves even and and everything's out of control and there's uh, the foods genetically modified and you know machines are taking over and all that stuff any of that consciousness at all the thing that heals all of that and reminds us in a visceral tangible physiological and energetic way what love actually is. The thing that can remind us of that immediately, you might not be able to connect with your guides, you might not be able to feel the angels or hear the angels, you might not even believe that there's a God, but if you get out into nature, that is one thing that will always immediately connect us all with the understanding of what love is, of what's real, of what that thing is that goes beyond words, that goes beyond the physical, that goes beyond explanation. So to experience a really high level of love and the highest learning of all today, get out into nature. Do something loving for yourself and for someone else. And if you can't feel that love, get away from everything and everyone, just for half an hour at least, and just sit next to a tree asking for nothing but an experience of nature and of the divine energy, the divine consciousness 
that flows through every living organic thing and always will, no matter what. Love is always present somewhere in every living thing. And Wednesday is going to be a great day to remind ourselves of that if that's what we need to do. So that's it for today everyone. I hope you've enjoyed that message. It felt quite important and meaningful and I hope that that's something that we're all going to remember in the time leading up to the holiday season. So that's it for today. I'm going to leave it there. Have a great Wednesday and I'll be back tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye.